If I'm doing gangs of Wasipur, there are scenes which are shot in heavy, hard light for coming from the top. But then the scene demands that. You want to depict heat. You want to depict, you know, hard people. That thing. So you use that kind of a light. I'll tell you one thing. What happens is a lot of times when I keep watching uh, these short films which students send me or somebody tells me, why don't you have a look at what I've done? Uh, I find that you, the people try and take the easiest way out. In filmmaking, shooting is the easiest part of filmmaking. It's the easiest part. Make sure that your script is correct. Okay. I mean, bust your head on the script. I'm telling you, that is the most important thing. Once that is done, spend a lot of time looking at your locations, understanding the light. Understand which side. I mean, when I go to a location, I've got a compass in my hand. I'm always looking at east west. I've got a sun path. I'm trying to figure out now these things are available on any, any Android phone today. Yeah? You know what a sun path is? Yeah. You know, there, there are apps which just, which you just, so I stand in the place and move my just phone around and I know exactly and based on that I decide what time we should come and shoot. The dirtiest, dirtiest, dirtiest kind of light that you can shoot in is the horrible Indian top sun. Okay. In India, for us to shoot between 11 and 3.30 in the afternoon should be banned. Because it's it's really terrible. It's really terrible. The sun is bang on top of it, extremely hard. And you get these patches like this under the eyes. Can you see this? And you need to keep filling that up. Because you look like phantom walking around with little Guran on the side, you know. So you have to be very, very careful about that. So therefore, when you are shooting, now you have to worry. Now, what 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 kind of light do I need? You know, so hang on, hang in a minute. That's my top light gone, but I've got a half light coming in on my face. You understand? But you need to get your exposures correct. So what is the blue I'm getting on my face? Is the blue coming in from the outside? That's, that's the natural light and the blue of the computer screen is popping on my face. Okay. So... So what is important is how you place your characters, how you use the sunlight. If there are windows, how you should use it. See, because very often you might see, if I'm shooting, I might take a very hard patch of light on the body, but the face is soft. So you diffuse the light off the face. But what happens I still have a backup of a lot of lights. So I know how to fill up, how much to fill up, but as a amateur filmmaker, where you have a lot of issues about not having enough light, but yet you want the picture to look nice, look at half lights. Okay. And don't shoot with the sun going too high. Keep the sun at 45 degrees around. Have you ever seen why films uh, shot in London or films shot in New York look so good? Because they never have top sun. Through the year, the sun is moving at, at, at 45 degrees. So you never get these deep shadows and stuff like that. So next time you're watching a foreign film, look at it. Okay. Similarly, now all our Indian films, especially if you see the good uh, uh, web series and all that are going on, this is very... Uh, ha has anybody seen a web series called Thinkistan? No. That's something I shot last year. And it's got a, uh, it's shot in a, in a huge space. It was almost a 9,000 square feet set, which was an office. You know, it's supposed to be on Nariman uh, Point, May, you know, in, in Bombay, a high-rise pay and advertising office. So what we did was we actually lit it for two parts. I lit it for the east-west. You know, so, so we could just switch off some lights and put on some lights. So when the evening was there, some other lights would come on. So, so the, how you, 
how you utilize the light so you need to think you can't come to the set and say badao kya shot hai i mean i spend days on location i spend hours thinking about how a scene should be lit you know look at the sun positioning you will never find unless you want to shoot it hard if i am doing gangs of wasipur there are scenes which i shot in heavy hard light for coming from the top but then the scene demands that you know want you want to depict heat you want to depict you, you know hard people i think so you use that kind of a light but if you are going to use a normal kind of a storytelling you should try and make the visual uh, uh, softer you know softer so a lot of your 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 picture and how you're going to shoot a picture depends immensely on what your script is therefore you your your every lighting is always going to be based differently you know you can't have the same lighting uh, for every every film that you shoot you know you don't wear the same t-shirt every day when you go for a party you change na so 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 that's all the thing you need to uh, be able to um, decode a script you know we spend lot of time with the director talking finding out what is in his mind because once you start shooting and and if you made certain mistakes in the beginning then, then very often it's very difficult to backtrack back so therefore you know this is something that was talked to me by my cinematography ka professor kulkarni sahab i was i remember i was in just entered second year and we were doing studio exercises and from morning i had been lighting up a scene and it was really looking shit it was bad news you know there was supposed to be a single source but ye wall pe shadow ja rahi thi wahan wall pe shadow ja rahi jo wall pe shadow aa rahi thi as to add a light wash shadow kill karne ke liye for that light would create another shadow on some other wall so i think about 2 hours later kulkarni sahab walked into the studio and he looked at me say kya kar raha hai so i told him sir wo ye shadow tha to yahi light lagaye wo light lagaye to wahan shadow hai wahan light lagaye to wahan ka shadow so he said jab galtiyan karte ho na switch off switch off everything and start again so so even at this stage today if i feel that things have not gone wrong and i'm still say i'm i'm two hours deep into the lighting you know i say okay lights off guys let's rethink this is not working 